I'm Robin Murray. I have been working at the University of Minnesota for probably close to 40 years um, with international students and with immigrant students. And my expertise is working with students as they move into their freshman undergraduate curriculum. I think second language writers have a number of challenges. Obviously language is one of them. What you're writing about can be a challenge. Um, how to write, the rhetorical conventions of writing, how, how much do you introduce a topic? How much is it appropriate to bring yourself into a topic? Um, the whole issue of plagiarism, when is it your words, when is it somebody else's words, and how do you handle all of the conventions of writing from sources, that's all very challenging. If you're giving a writing assignment, I think it would be very helpful for a second language student to have some samples, maybe old student papers to look at, just to get a sense of what should that writing be looking like, to unpack the assignment, um, sort of explain what's, what an, a good introduction should look like, what you're looking for in the assignment. Those can all be useful. I invite students to write down when they have questions. If they're not sure, is this enough information here, or have I quoted this properly, or is this transition phrase good enough, I invite them to, on a, maybe on a post-it note, add that to the, to the paper. Here are my questions. I think it's important to tolerate an accent in the writing and not get too hung up on language issues. So make sure that, that feedback is focusing on what the writer is saying. Um, have a friendly response <laughs> and not get too hung up on, on copy editing. You can circle errors, but maybe you know why it's an error, but the person who wrote that maybe doesn't understand what the rule is behind it. So all you're really doing is circling on a piece of paper and not helping the writer become better.